Hi, and today, this ain't gonna be a review, oh no it isn't, this is an Omega Extreme Epic Rat, on Norm of the North 2, Keys to the Kingdom. So let's get started. The plot for Norm of the North 2, Keys to the Kingdom is, it takes place immediately after the first movie left off. Here we have Norm the Polar Bear returns like, oh, I'm not excited for this film. And then here we have Mrs. Brightly and Olympia, who had to go on failure adventures again, and including the lemmings, and to meet with the mayor, who wants to be powerful as a king. And then, which suddenly happens is, and it's pretty much like the same old garbage plot. And here we have meet the new character named Kung Fu Rabbit, which is essentially ripoff of Poe from Kung Fu Panda and Peter Rabbit from the 2018 live action film named Peter Rabbit. And yes, soon as the mayor is defeated, but Norm is trying to do ice hockey, uh, ice hockey game for no good reason. And then, yay! The end of this movie, yeah. That's it for the plot. <sighs> what have I heard of this sequel? It stinks so much. I never watched this film, not anymore, and I never will. The animation is so disgusting. The story, really horrendous. The characters, we have Norm, the main character, my absolute worst main character of them all. The mayor, the mayor, it's annoying. And Kung Fu Rabbit. The Kung Fu Rabbit is essentially a ripoff to Poe and Peter Rabbit. And all the other characters are so bad. <gasps> thankfully, I never watched it on Netflix. And thankfully, I haven't bought it. And I never will. But instead, I just saw A Dog's Way Home instead back in the last January 2019. <sighs> so, overall... I'm going to give it a negative 0 out of 10. This film stinks so much. Anyway, I'll be doing an ultimate mega extreme epic rant on Norm of a North King Size Adventure. Goodbye.